Okay, so we just got home from the store and we got this new cart. It's called Gorilla Carts and it's a four wheel like cart, garden cart, except it also works like a dump, like a dump truck, see? So it works like a wheelbarrow, but it's got four wheels, so it's more stable. So we're pretty excited about this. So Mark's gonna put it together for us. And I'll put a link below. We got ours at Walmart. Uh, the lowest price that we found online was $99, and that was at Home Depot. At Walmart, it was $74.95. Woo-hoo! Cha-ching! So it acts like a wheelbarrow or a dump truck. So if you have a big load of dirt, you just have a quick release feature and it just dumps right out. So it holds 600 pounds. It's plastic, which is nice because uh, it's not gonna rust on you. And 10 inch pneumatic wheels for easy cruising. Had to been made in America or in China under American supervision. Yeah, I think it does say it's made in China. Oh well. Need some help? There we go. I can do it. And make sure I got this right. I do. Oh, there we go. This is what happens when you don't use help. Now, where'd that bolt go? <laughs> Found it. There it is. There we go. So what part is that? This is doohickey number two in conjunction with step number one. <laughs> oh, I see how it works. It's just like that. Oops! Dropped it again. Uh, found it! There's that. And I need this doohickey. This is doohickey for step number three. <laughs> and according to this, these little rubber stopper things come off. I might have saved that. That could be useful for something. Oh, I have a feeling that will go in the tinkering pile. Tinkering pile. You never know when you're going to need something. And that is why it took two 26-foot trucks to get us to <laughs> Texas. <laughs> Washer. Nut. Ah, uh, nuts. Socket wrench. The nuts that they come with are really nice nuts. I don't know if you can see that, but there's a vinyl insert. And that basically acts like a lock washer. So when you screw the thing down, it doesn't slowly work its way off. You can show it who's boss, baby. Yeah. Flip the camera around. That's the boss. <laughs> it's true. Step number four. It's a pretty well built little trailer. All right. This goes on just like so. You want me to hold this edge right here? So... Sure. So it doesn't fall off and I look like an idiot on camera. You know, this would be a good job if you had a kid. You could put the kid underneath and push those through so you wouldn't have to bend over like that. Yeah, but I got you. You want to do it? Nope. Oh, man. That looks like it might go with this because it's got a big hole. Yep. So, that's good. I'm pushing. There we go. And this will go on top. I need a bigger wrench. Is this one going to be big enough? Just barely, but it works. You don't have a socket big enough or a ratcheting something? Yes, I do have a socket. And it's in storage in Waco. Have you 
showed everybody our new trailer? Not yet. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Spoiler alert. <laughs> it's right there. Maybe you got it too tight. Just a tad. There. There we there go. We go. Perfect. So we're putting this together on our little um, stand because we're fat and old, but this looks like it'd probably be easier to put together on the ground. Then it wouldn't fall off the table every time you try to turn a nut. But then I'd have to get down on my knees and that would hurt. That's why I'm saying not you, and not you, the people watching. Okay, what are we on, step number six? Step number six. So exciting. Putting the wheels on. And this should be pretty simple. It's just washers. Washers and pins. Washers and wheels. Do we have to blow up the tires? It doesn't seem to be. Are they solid? Uh, well, I have to check. It does feel a little squishy. I'll check the air pressure. What is the maximum inflation on this thing? Oh, it says 2.04 bars. What does that mean? Give me a PSI. Who are these foreign people? Here, here we go. 30 PSI. Okay, that I can work with. 2.7 bars. Washer. Cutter pin. What is it called? Cutter pin. Cotter pin? Yep. Because the guy who's, who invented it, his name was Carter? Could be. It's real simple. Just stick it in, bend those out so it doesn't come back out and it holds everything in place. Nice. Okay, all four tires are on. Step number seven. Last step. Come on, you turkey. Get out of there. There. Pretty simple. Simple Simon. Aren't you so glad you have to do all this stuff on camera in front of everybody? <laughs> yeah. So they get to see me watch, watch me drop everything. All right. all right, take it for a spin. You want to go for a ride? You look really cute pulling your wagon. <laughs> if only I had a Red Rider beep again. <laughs> <laughs> this utility tractor holds up to 600 pounds. Mark is not 600 pounds, but we're going to go for a ride. Yay! Pull me, Carrie. Oh! Yes, this is about the easiest I've ever taken you for a ride. For a ride. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's our little home improvement project for today. Not bad for day five. <laughs> Death? Oh, sorry, truck going by. It's right there. Careful, I don't have one. It's right there. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, what are we gonna call this thing? Our our 100 year old farmhouse. Our 100 and one and three quarter acres. <laughs> 101 year old house and three quarter acres. Yeah. 101.75. <laughs> Look, this thing holds 600 pounds. Mark wait, is not 600 wait. pounds. <laughs> the rats aren't going to eat our cart. <laughs> Okay. 
now all we have to do is get it over the top of the plastic so we don't break the plastic. Yeah. Ready? Let's just let the thing dip off and in. Oh my gosh. Whew. Whew. That thing is massive. I need you to help hold me. Check that puppy out. Oh my gosh. It's huge. Come over here instead of me. I'm going to try and tip it over. Yeah. Maybe stand over here. There we go. That's good enough. Good enough. And we did not break the cart. Okay. This cart is really durable. It carried that massive stone, even though it was like on the side of the plastic, I thought for sure it was gonna break, but it went right in. Gorilla carts, we're in love.